Hello everyone, I'm the Dino Gamer. Welcome back to another Dinosaur Factory video. In today's video, we have the mighty Yamna Shrek facing up against the gigantic Megalodon. And looking at these two pictures side by side as a comparison, you can see the Megalodon is quite a bit bigger than the Yamna Shreks. Almost twice as long and, well, so much bulkier. So, who do you think will win? A Megalodon or Yamna Shrek? This Megalodon is much stronger than T-Rex and by the way this I-Rex is aquatic, he's in the water, he can breathe from the water. Anyway, without further ado, well, I'm not sure if this dot raw before launching into an attack and right in the face with the Mika Megalodon. So far looks about even actually. The I-Rex has given advantage with damage. But Megalodon, of course, has the bridge swim and that very weird attack. Ooh, that tail side did so much damage, and the Dominus Rex is successful. Lost about one eighth of its health, but pretty much okay. Now, since well, that battle was a total wipe, Dominus Rex, let's add. 3 more. 3v1. Let's see what will happen. Megalodon lands first. The first attack. Catching the entire head of the Rex actually inside it. That tail attack is so much damage. You can see the Indominus Rex at the back and killed only by its tail. The bite and claw attack don't do as much damage but they are more accurate, I'd say. And looks like Indominus Rex will be successful once again. Yep, Indominus Rex totally wiped the floor with them. Now let's add two more Megalodons again. Let's put them further back. For a grand total of five Megalodons versus one Indominus Rex. And of course, they land the first attacks. The other two are coming into the sides, left and right. One has its arm, a pretty good tactic, you can use it, and it's up. That's a weird attack, and that's a very creepy. It has the ability to shoot its tongue out at targets, and its tongue are covered with these te teeth, which are bigger than the teeth itself of the Megalodon. But now he's actually having quite a bit of trouble. Actually, can't land a proper attack because his head is inside the Megalodon. So he, he may actually be victorious. And did he kill any? He managed to kill one Megalodon, but well, he was eventually bested. Now we're done with the Megalodons. Let's try a Mosasaurus because, as you may have seen from the movie, um, Indominus Rex is no match for Mosasaurus. And well, that size comparison is huge. And that was over incredibly quickly. Indominus Rex is once again success successful in the hunt. Killed the Mosasaurus. Just for good measure, let's try five. This time smaller ones. And let's see. Okay, they're doing damage pretty fast them actually. He does more than a quick span of time, but there are so many mouths and fins attacking him. So we had to see if it's actually successful. Though to me it looks like it'll be very close. And the Moses versus are victorious with just one guy remaining with like one sixteenth of its health remaining. Yeah. So that's it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please consider leaving a like, subscribing, and until next time, I'll see you later. Bye for now.